Rainbow Ink! Hey guys and welcome back to Rainbow Ink. Today is another Disney Bound Friday. We are doing Penny Proud from the Proud Family. We do have a full outfit today so I didn't jinx us like last time like I thought we would. Still going strong on that full outfit attire. We are layering today. Anything that was used in past Disney Bounds will be a card right up there. Also in the link description below if you guys like to check that out as well to see how I did it in that video. Like I said, we do have a full outfit today so let's work our way up starting with the shoes. And for shoes, I have a pair of dark red, like, burgundy shoes. I know hers is more, I think, like, tennis shoes or whatever. But I just have burgundy flats here. So, yeah. And I never used these before, so they're making their Disneyland debut. Yay! For the pants, or for, in this case, a skirt, because she does wear a skirt, I just have a red burgundy colored skirt. I've used this skirt a lot of different ways. Last time I used this, and hopefully I'm saying this right, Right, with Soka Tatana. Don't know if I said that right. From Star Wars. It was earlier this year. I think it was literally our second Disney Bound this year. So that's fun. Like I said in the beginning, we are layering today. So this will be our first layer. And our first layer, I don't know if it's a tank top or a white t shirt. I just picked with the white t shirt route. But I just have a short sleeve white t shirt. Um, to be blatantly honest with you, I don't know if this is making its Disney Bound debut or if I technically have used this out an actual piece before. I know in the past I've used like a white t-shirt or um, a white tank top as an undershirt in the past and I really haven't counted but this time it's getting counted so I think it, it is making its Dizzy Bound debut so that is fun for me. And then for our final piece I just have my favorite red cardigan. <laughs> it's just a long sleeve cardigan, of course. It's supposed to be her red cardigan slash jacket. But anyways, I get to use this cardigan again. And of course, the last time this cardigan was used was in Star Lord out there. Also in the description below, there's that. And that's it for the closeaways. Um, for my hair, I plan on just taking out my ponytail and actually making two ponytails to come down. Because that's what she actually has. She has technically like two pigtails coming down. So I'm gonna try and attempt that. So yeah, this is what I had. Let's see how it all looks together. Okay, um, I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. I hate having my hair like this because <laughs> it reminds me of grade school. Um, but anyways, um, I don't think this is half bad besides me hating how my hair is, but I'm only doing this for the Disney Bound. Um, so <laughs> it's bad. Um, anyways. Alright, here are the shoes. They're just normal burgundy flats. Please mind my socks, but anyways, shoes. I have this skirt here, this shirt, which I believe it is making its debut as a new item, and then the cardigan, of course. I really like this cardigan so much, and so as you can tell, I went with the red look, and this is the new one. I know usually I do the older ones, but I did the new one because it's easier. And like you can already see with my hair, I have it in pigtails the way she has. And I kind of don't like it. Uh, I kind of really don't like it. And it makes me look stupid. I feel with the pigtails, this makes me all look stupid. So why don't I do this? Take my hair out of my pigtails. Better? Okay, this is a tiny bit better. I feel a little bit better in this. <laughs> No, even though the pigtails are supposed to be a part of it because she has pigtails for some unknown reason, even though she's like a teenager, so. Mm. Um, anyways guys, I don't think this is a bad Disney Bound. Only negative thing I had was the hair, which now looks mostly better with my hair just being down and going crazy. Anyways guys, I don't think this is a bad outfit. I do think sadly with the pigtails, people might figure it out with the pigtails or they might not. I don't know. I feel like this would be a good outfit like for casual wear. And again, this is like still Disney Mountains are supposed to be casual wear for the hair order and stuff like that. And she doesn't like wear anything like big and extravagant for that. She does wear casual clothes and, and yeah. So I don't know. I think I got the color down good and everything else. I think this was a good Disney Bound. But that's for you guys to decide in the comments below if you think this was a good Disney Bound or a bad Disney Bound. Why don't you guys do that? I'll pull our next character that you will hopefully get in two weeks. 
Where did I go? That over there, so I, it doesn't fall off the bed. Okay. Um, the Grand Duke from Cinderella. That's the guy in blue, right? That like carries out the slipper. Huh. How am I gonna do that? Well, you'll have to see here next time on Rainbowing, hopefully in two weeks, to see a dizzy mount of the Grand Duke from Cinderella. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to like and subscribe. All that beautiful jazz. Last video right there. Subscriber beneath me. Playlist of all of the videos so far from 2024 Disney mounds right up there. Also be in the link description below with a Disney playlist and I'll see you guys next time here. Have a good week. Bye!